Welcome back to the channel. This is Andrew, Running with Dr. Andrew. And today is another midweek training talk. All right, guys, let's go. So today I'd like to talk to you about uh, are tempo runs very important? I really think that they are something that you can add to your program, especially if you're wanting to get a specific time in a marathon training block. Um, it's something that can help you out with running faster for longer periods of time and help build up that lactate. It also helps improve strength with your running, something that I've been doing uh, for some time and adding to that program each week there. So number one is definitely is be able to turn your legs over quicker. And so we want to be able to get used to going fast for a long period of time. And the main thing is getting those legs to turn over very, uh, quicker than you normally would on a uh, easy run. <clears throat> um, and so number two, uh, definitely this is going to help out with your aerobic, anaerobic type of uh, endurance. So we've got aerobic, which is oxygen. You're going slower, your slow long runs are more aerobic. And this is a little bit more anaerobic where you kind of build up that lactate and that burn in your legs. So that way you're getting used to going faster for longer periods of time. I think it's very important and also helps improve with your strength um, while doing this. Um, so another thing that tempo runs can do is help you efficiently clear out lactate. The lactate is the thing in your muscles that you can feel the burn and makes you kind of want to stop because you're running too hard. So definitely there's something you can help improve your, your uh, marathon time. Um, increasing your this can increase your VO2 max which is your body's capacity in order uh, to um, uh, utilize oxygen while exercising and also like I said it can improve your overall endurance now typically you might want to do this one time a week or maybe even two times a week and uh, you can you know like today I did a tempo run I did a three mile warm-up just for aerobic and then rested for a little bit and did a four mile tempo run and did a three mile cool down so you can kind of do it in the whole workout or you can do it in a long run you know you can just you know continue to run and at a certain point do a couple mile uh, tempo run and then go back to your normal uh, long run type of pace and that will something will definitely help you out kind of um, you know add these runs throughout your workouts if you can sometimes and also like I said you can do this on the track doing a speed work and doing tempo runs shorter tempo runs uh, like doing mile repeats and things like that and that's definitely very helpful for you in order to build up your speed and get the times that you want to do now definitely obviously you're not going to be doing this every workout because your legs will get tired and fatigue very quickly but also these tempo runs will help improve your fatigue so that's kind of what we're trying to do all right guys this concludes this week's midweek training talk uh, this week I've finished about 12 miles so far my goal is to get up to 55. Let me know in the comments how your training is going. Are you training for any type of marathons? I know we're probably pretty close to starting uh, marathon blocks for the fall marathons. Hope everyone's staying cool outside. Keep safe. Keep running. And we'll see you next time.